right, NC Fox is going to be a bit of an uphill battle here for these guys. The young up-and-coming roster. These players have had some pretty nice individual performances, but now it is time to prove themselves going up against Kongzu Pantera. Oh, Rascal going to get jumped on. It goes very low. It's on that healing coming through as he tries to stay alive. Punch oh. it onto Sasan and takes him out right after Pumple goes down. Also get the pop out onto that mech. So Rhea will fall, and that is going to be a very swift take as uh, Rascal, well, you know, he shows off just a little bit here with this Doom Fist. He gets three kills there. I feel like will finally jump down, but that's going to be Hayak going down first and foremost as Rascal comes up with another kill, and then taking down Sasan yet again. Long to Panthera just wipe them out. He's looking for a bit more punch into the wall with his Discord Orb. Means that Rhea is knocked out. Doesn't the pick on to Curious. Your strike coming down. Not gonna be finding the kill, but gets a lot of damage in. And with one oh, final yes. shot from the hand cannon, Rascal yet again comes up with the kill. With an old disadvantage in such a heavy dive comp for Pan to have this one. It's not looking likely. Rascal going low, but the Dragon Blade comes through, and the Pulse Bomb will be able to take it down. So Sokinsu finds that opening, but is that going to be enough? Both of there are throwing everything that they have, including the self destruct. And it won't find the picks, but the rest of the team is. So Minsu being taken out by Waka Waka. Near wipe coming through his Neko. Finally throws out the EMP, Can't but it's with just a Lucio there to try to pick up the pieces. goes to the boxes, which is so huge, because even if they lose this fight now, they can buy a lot of time, build up that percentage. The pharmacy's already been dismantled there as Neko goes down, but the Rio. self destruct from Rio comes up with two, and it's going to be both supports as Dosen and Waka Waka both get taken out. Sasan alone in the skies is rather low. He's trying to find the sniper on a there in midair. He will not be able to do so, but he does force him back. He's so looking close. for the punch. Oh, <laughs> can't quite make it on top of the wall. But uh, Rascal's showing off some of that mobility there from the Doomfist. We will be seeing a flip likely very soon. Res available. But they are pushing back in. They're going to try to keep this one going. The barrage comes down. Double res comes out from Neko. Tries to bring tries to bring them back in. As Curious does get taken out. But Rascal has found Sasan, who's been instrumental to the Fox's success thus far. But Humble here with his Primal Rage just wants to build as much percentage as humanly possible. Yeah, I mean, they're using a lot of ultimates here, but they're just buying percentage right now. Neko actually pocketing Pumple right now will finally be taken out. Builds up half of another res, so I think they can be happy about how this flip is going to doing so much damage. They forced out the sound barrier early, and here comes Curious. He's trying to shut down the Pharah. Tac Visor available. Pharah can't get into range now because of this Tac Visor. She can't find the angle. He can't get around to take her out as well, but they still did so much work here as they are in overtime. It's all about Foxes trying to go for this retake. Minsu is swapped over onto that Doom Fist and has 40% on the Meteor Strike building up, but it's, it might not be fast enough because Rascal's already got his and Sasan has been taken out. And without Neko on that Mercy, there's no way to bring him back in. Now Rascal, Meteor Strike coming through, looking for the pick. Will just go ahead and drop him down. And that might just be the end of it here. Just the Baby Diva trying to contest. Doom Fist here tries to get him. <laughs> not going to happen. Well, that's a one point here for Panthera. All things considered, remember, this was the best map type of the Fox. He's going like the quadra kill the 3K, and he's like, all right, never mind, you can keep playing that one. Exactly. So I think they'll be pretty happy with the end result there as Neko does go down. Rascal with a flank takes him out. Now look at the kill on the Sominsu. We'll be matching Meteor Strikes, I do believe. Yep. They both throw them out. Yep. Comes down, but Rascal's going to be the one walking away with the kills. He gets rid of Pumple now, looking for the enemy Doom Fist. Finds that point blank curious. range. And Curious will go ahead and scoop up. Pumple has to go ahead and throw out the bubble with the Primal Rage. Nana Boost on top is trying desperately to get people away from the payload to stop it from inching forward. But right now, it's uncontested. It's just going in. They'll finally stop it, but it's under four meters left with multiple people dead on the side of the boxes. Uh, and the Primal Rage not used to defend it, so no longer available. Used to try to get picks, failed to get the pick onto Curious who's about to have the dead eye here. This may just be the completion. There's just way more tools on the side of Panthera. And so the only answer one if he gets rid of uh, Vados in there, but that's about it. Dead eye now coming out curious, trying to zone them back. Neko trying to get in onto the point, but the uppercut will come through, takes him out, gets rid of Minsu. here. Now, very Still ticking up. Very greedy to use the McCree like this, but with a flashbang kill on the Tracer, he seems to be afraid of nothing. Gets a second one, misses the headshot this time, though. Can't quite get it, just not fast enough to follow up with that one. In the meantime, Fisher jumping forward, finishes off Minsu, but goes dangerously low and has to stay alive if they want to contest this one, but he does get taken down by Rhea in the end, as does Curious. So the, the delay tactics from the side of Kongju Panthera have all pretty much been exhausted, and that will be the cap very swiftly, faster than you would have expected for the Fox. Really nice accuracy, shooting. Threading the needle through the wall there of that building. 
There's already more picks coming in for the Foxes. Down on Ultimates yet again. Both supports have been taken out, but Mitsu will get traded back by Rascal, who kills him with that Rocket Punch. Rascal going dangerously, though, can't use a Meteor Strike in time and almost had the kill there on the Neko, but just cannot get the completion. And the payload keeps moving. Great pacing here for MC Foxes. Oh, certainly so. And Kino, no fear. He's the one who's diving the backline himself. As McCree has the pocket defense here from Rhea. Here comes the Dead Eye. Look at this, using the self-destruct in conjunction, unfortunately gets stuck onto the high ground there. Yeah, everybody hides back, they get themselves safe. He gets a pop onto Boyd's mech. That's how Mary does come down. Rascal landing, gets rid of Neko. But he needs to do so much more than that if they want to win the fight. Mitsu falling down, allevi alleviates a lot of pressure here for Colton Bintera on this defense. And the run back is going to be too significant, so Foxes feel the need to go ahead and kite back. And it's really cool to see McCree making such a comeback in the meta right now, especially on this map you were watching. The great accuracy out of both Kino and Curious. Well, Neko going down is not going to be a very good start here for the Foxes on this tackle. He's on a, onto Hayuk as well. And it's going to be a very nice cleanup for Kong Dupan there to start things off with. As it's just 30 seconds remaining, so it's going to be one final push from the side of the boxes and try to get this done. But if they complete these staggers, that is going to hurt them so very much. Kino being lost that late. And now Rhea popped out of the back. That's yeah. such a crucial pickoff for going to Bandera. So they don't have any ultimates, obviously. This is going to be basically the game-deciding fight, very likely, for the Foxes. They need this cap now. Trying to get rid of Minsu, and oh, they will down. do so. But Osin comes up with the kill. They lose out on the Rascal as well, but Hyuk falling is going to be both supports. Pretty much negated as Neko is so dangerously low, and Bidosin has that transcendence going through. So. They have to be careful about Kino here with the McCree. He's already shown proficiency, landing those flashbangs into the headshots. Coming through from Pumple, knocked into the corner. He's isolated, will get taken down as Void finds the kill. Curious goes low, and Void will get popped out of the back. And Rhea is not in position either. He's going to probably be d in just a second. Does not Void out while doing so, though, and gets a pick on to Curious. It's going to be a nice one, but Rascal still has gotten rid of the enemy Doom Fist. Now can go ahead and finish off Rhea. Jump in's coming through from Hyuk as he tries to delay oh, a little here. bit, but it's still just ticking up, and that Pumple. might be it. There you go, Kong Do Panthera. Didn't take very long. Pumple get the cap. went in so deep there. They didn't have true die when they based pop. off against Flash Lux here. And Panthera, why not? Why it changed what's not broken? They're going to be running the mirror comp as well. Good dodge away from the fist right there from Rascal. Doesn't find the connection in on Minsu. As Curious gets taken down very early on. Rascal as well will fall as Rio finds the kill. And it seems like Kongdu Panthera weren't quite ready for this one. Too busy messing around trying to land on top of the telephone pole and instead they just weren't ready to fight and they get just taken out and that might be a very fast cap one of the fastest that i've seen this rascal gets taken out off screen will be kept alive but neko's investing the transcendence on the back of this one so maybe they want to go ahead and use yuck sound barrier as well they will do just that as they look yet again for the fight to take the map Scored orb thrown down onto Fisher. He'll get cut down by the tag visor here from Kino, who's just firing away. Finds Waka Waka as well. That's with a meteor strike coming down onto the high ground. Not going to be funny anything. He has to jump back in onto the point to help keep the point in contention. And Foxes, I mean, they dump everything, but they don't have anybody really going down onto the point itself to try to get the meter rolling. Yeah. Okay, Kino though, he's on the high ground. This is what I was talking about. Free damage here. Gets the flames here. And finally, they are staggering the response. They need to get that control of the spawn room. Already the primal rage was used, but Pumple is trying to zone out. Here comes Fisher. They need to focus him down. Really good barrier. Kind of making uh, Kino worthless right now in terms of range fighting, but he's looking for Rascal. Looking for that pick again, and he gets it. Oh, takes him down. Discord Orb comes in perfectly timed there from the side of Neko, and they kill him in the mid-dash. Second tick still has not come through yet for the side of the Foxes, but they're dangerously close now. Ticking up for 88, 95% with that transcendence thrown in. Kong Dupan there is struggling, and nobody has picked up the May. No one can this kill might Kino. Might just be the completion. Self-destruct thrown up into the air. Kino just hides behind the pillar. He's perfectly fine. They keep playing like this. Fisher leaping in. Will get taken down, and that should be it. Yeah, they bought a lot of shots come through from him. Rascal jumps in, gets a bit of damage with the seismic slam. Good positioning here, though, for the Foxes. He's not able to get the pick he wanted. They still Boy, do find Neko. Yeah, that's going to be the only support going down. And Yuck is still a very far away away from that. EMP coming through, so this might just be yet another very swift cap as Rascal picks up the 2k, getting rid of Rhea and Hyuk. Kino does fire back, gets rid of Bidosin, but with everybody else being jumped on, seems like this might just be in here very early on for the side of Kongju Panthera. That's the worst kick to have happen, too, on your solo support. Sure, health packs can do health packs can do wonders, or in fact, he is going to be more aggressive. What? Oh, they punched each other and got the knockdown? <laughs> That's one of the first times I believe I've seen this interaction. 
Gear Strike into the back, but it's gonna be a wraparound from Hayuk, and he keeps himself safe and gets the kill to answer on to Rascal. Self-destruct, not gonna be finding anything here. Already tick granted here, though, for Panthera. I think it might be just shy of it. Honestly, it's really hard to tell, but they need a little bit more, I'm pretty sure. There we go, we'll guarantee it. Multiple kills coming through, four members dead, now respawning. Minsu taken out immediately, and that Dojo might just be triple. it. They have him zoned back with the poop. Can they get the completion? Oh, he's knocked Rumble. away. Gets knocked away, but now has the primal rage to buy even more time. Discord Orb is thrown down onto him, and the May is coming through immediately Trans from Neko, but he gets taken out. Humble still trying to leap his way back in, just a second alone on the point. We'll hand this one over to Kongdu Panthera, and they desperately want this completion, but losing out on Waka Waka is not helping them at all. Oh, Curious is going down so as well. Work. They might have actually held this off. Looks like he might be able to push them back here, switching over to the Tracer. Transcendence now protecting him, and it looks like they will, at least for the time being, get the hold. Curious. Go ahead, keep dashing around, but he gets taken down, and that will be the hold, as you say, so dangerously All right, cool. let's watch this again. Stick seven. Dodges out on the damage of the recall. Yeah, Rascal is healed denied here. Won't be able to have much sustain. Does survive through it regardless. Does have the Meteor Strike. We'll see how he wants to use it as his opponent's already launched one. Sue coming down looking for something. Doesn't find anything. But Curious has been taken out. Self Destruct. Well timed there from Boy. Does get rid of that Doom Fist and they follow up in on to Pumple. Rhea knocked out of the mech. Four members effectively dead. As they go ahead and start things up yet again on the side of Pongu Panthera looking for the completion. They might have at this time a round instant kill in onto the Doom Fist. There you go. Come on to Fisher here, but he immediately leaps out. This is, allows Rascal free reign on oh the back my line. Oh god, just smacking him down left and right. Hayak got a fall. Gets the health pack. Just goes ahead and picks that one up. Seismic slam to finish off Rhea after he helps knock him out. I hope that Kino gets a pick perhaps. They can't lose anybody here or it's all over. He's keeping himself alive, has a meteor strike, is trying to bait them back into the building. Does find Neko, takes him down, one blast with a hand cannon, finds the kill. Nice big slam, gets himself up onto the high ground and stays into this one, but I mean, if they get a pick or two, it could all just end in a flash. And the big one could be the support ultimate error as Waka Waka nearly has it ready to go, but Pumple and Somensu going down right off the bat is not looking good for the boxes. Rhea popped out of the mech as well. Kongu Benthera, they don't want to waste any more time. They just want to go ahead and end it right here, and that is going to be it. And as you say, Boop comes through. They will go ahead, push them away. Get on to the point, get that 33% cap. So Kong to Panthera oh. will come up with the 3-0. 오늘은 제가 이제 주전이 아니라 후보로 이제 벤치에서 이제 주전 선수들 경기하는 거 봐, 지켜봤는데 그래도 큐리가 저만큼 이제 제 포지션에 맞게끔 큐리가 잘 해줘서 오늘 경기 한 3대 3대 0잘 나왔다고 생각해요. 어, 제 자신의 영웅은 이제, 이제 맥크리, 원래 시즌 1 때부터 맥크리를 자주 했어가지고, <웃음> 그래도 약간 맥크리에 대해서는 좀 뭔가 자존심? 그런 것도 좀 있고, 맥크리도 간간히 요새 메타에 이제 다시 좀 맥크리가 많이 나오는데, 그래서 다시 좀 맥크리 연습을 하고 있는 상태라, 그래도 자신 있는 거는 맥크리입니다. 맥크리 트레이 선수고. 이제, 히트 스캔을 하다가 투사체를 하면은 투사체는 그래도 상대방의 무빙을 예측해서 맞춰야 되는 거고 히트 스캔 정확히 상대방의 몸에 이제 M을 두는 게 차인데 저 같은 경우에는 사실 그게 어떤 날은 뭐 히트 스캔이 잘안될 때는 뭐 투사체가 잘 되고 뭐 투사체가 안될 때는 히트 스캔이 잘 되고 뭐 이런 편인데 아무래도 둘다잘된 날은 그래도 연습량의 차이라고 생각해요. 저 또한 초창기 때부터 뭐 맥크리도 자주 했지만 겐지도 엄청 자주 많이 한 편이라서 뭐 예전부터 많이 해와서 좀 적응하기 이렇게 바꿨을 때 적응하기는 좀 빠르게 되는 것 같아요 요새. <웃음> 어, 딜러는 솔직히 같이 하고 싶은 사람은 콩주 제외하고 하면은 좀 많긴 한데, 뭐, 일단, 뭐, 플라워? 나무 하나 플라워 선수 있고, 뭐, 플레타도 있는데, 지금 당장으로서는 플라워 선수랑 같이 뭐, 주 이제 해보고 싶은 마음이 좀 있어요.